it's very important for us to understand how patients behave in terms of their beliefs, religious affiliation, their cultural background, to understand and see this patient as a whole and uh, not to miss anything in their uh, treatment and their uh, patient care. Uh, many patients in uh, uh, the world population is nine, at least 9% religious with some religious affiliation. Uh, almost 100%, 95 and, and more of people worldwide also believe in God. Um, so at, at least some issues regarding their uh, practices, their beliefs, will be uh, important for more than 90% of people. And um, if we need to understand patients as a whole and treat them as a, an individual, uh, looking at their health issues, their mental status, and their spiritual and religious beliefs will uh, probably do a, a better job in taking care of these patients. I think it's very important for us to understand how patients' pain can behave in terms of their religiosity and spirituality. Uh, first, a very important issue is how optimism is related to placebo response in pain patients. Uh, faith, belief in uh, life after death, and uh, the importance of, uh, again, comorbidity related to pain disorders and how spirituality affects uh, depression and anxiety uh, and uh, of course if we can um, understand better this patient and uh, integrate spirituality in their treatment I think we'll have a better outcomes and a, a, a better pain response.